You're listening to Mr. Strauss Podcast. Oh, boy. <laughs> For January 8th, on this day in Disney history. On this day in 1956, Disneyland's The Mickey Mouse Club Circus, an attraction running since November 1955, officially closes. It was the first major addition to Disneyland. The circus was held in a pink and white striped tent, which was set up in the area that later will house the Fantasyland Autopia. Capitalizing on the success of the Mickey Mouse Club TV series, the 75-minute circus show featured a cast of well-known Mouseketeers who were thrilled to be able to ride horses and work the trapezes. This circus was one of Walt Disney's few failures. He was fascinated by circuses, but guests visiting Disneyland had too many other fun things to see and do to spend their time sitting under a big top seeing a circus. After all, they could see a circus anywhere. There was only one Disneyland. Due to poor attendance, the Mickey Mouse Club Circus only lasted over one Christmas season. The tent, which Disney had bought, saw later usage in Holiday Land for corporate picnics and other events. 